Hello guys, it's Styler here and uh, I upgraded my Yumi Ion firmware to version 1.6 and thought why not show you some of the new features in a quick video. Because Yumi added a unique feature or option that I never have seen before on any other phone. The highlight in this update is that you can now disable the on-screen software buttons and enable hardware buttons instead. This is great for all who don't like on-screen software buttons. I'm sure some will think that this is not possible, but uh, in fact it is. I guess that uh, the Yumi Iron from the very beginning also had hidden hardware touch buttons, but uh, just without any kind of backlight, so they would not be visible for the user. So let me first show you how the phone normally looks like with the on-screen buttons. Uh, when we go into the settings and um, then scroll down to accessibility, we here also now find navigation bar. In here you can change the order of the menu and back buttons, but we also find something called keypad type, where you now can choose from virtual keypad or entity keypad. So virtual is the on-screen software buttons, while entity keypad will remove the on-screen software buttons and convert them down to hardware buttons. So let's now try to activate this and let me now also reboot the device. Okay, so now the phone has rebooted and notice that the on-screen software buttons are completely gone now. And let's try. Yes, we now actually have hardware touch buttons here activated, just without any kind of backlight, but they are there and they can be used just fine. Another small feature is that you can also now swipe down anywhere on the home screen to open up the notification drawer, so you don't have to actually put your finger at the top of the screen. And in the quick toggles we have convenient features like an end all button and a shortcut to the battery saver. So that's it for the video, thank you for watching and see you the next time, bye bye.